everyone wants to provide for the ones they love, but normally that's just your immediate family. Well, in Whangarei, there's a couple not only providing for their four children, but two sets of grandparents as well. A former cop, two freezing workers, and a dental technician, actually that sounds like the beginning of a joke, are now packing bras in a family maternity wear business that's rapidly expanding. This cruise in the family way. I'm the number one packer. Just remember that. Two sets of grandparents in charge of deliveries. This is the F up board. This is for people who make a lot of mistakes. Yeah, you've had it. And uh, my right son's up. just uh, put me back up on the board, so this is not true though. Caden Shea's the brainchild of former personal trainers Adam and Nikki. Their maternity activewear business was born shortly after their first child. I went to get dressed to go to the gym to go work out and do my own, like do my own workout as well as train clients. And I realised that I just had nothing to wear. I want to move. I want to exercise. I want to feel good. But there were no clothes that I could wear that I could breastfeed in. Cue an aha moment. You don't gotta go to work. She came out and she goes, oh, I've got an idea. I've got an idea and it's, it's going to go off. And I, I, I could see, yeah, go you, did, you said, I need you to take all my clients because I'm going to work on this idea and I can just see by the look in her face that it was something good. And after a 14-month gestation, the arrival of baby number two and a lot of boxes, Caden Shea was born. We can work Devotees include Valerie Adams, Gemma McCaw, and UFC star Misha Tate. Remember, we got the first sale. Oh, really? like, yeah. so exciting. People were buying our stuff. You know, we'd get an order, and I was like, oh my god, that's someone in Bangarei. Let's like go and drive it to them that day. Chuck the two so... kids in the car, door to door service. Their business is named after their firstborn, Caden, middle name Shay. When baby number three joined them, it was time to call in the big guns. I moved mum and dad up from uh, Matoda, where I'm originally from. Uh, it's about half an hour north of. Uh, in Vicargill. Ken and Tanya were at the freezing works. I knew they were working big hours, like six days a week. Nikki's dad, Steve, was a policeman. He was doing night shift at the time and I, yeah, I just sort of thought, God, there's, there's got to be a better way. So did mum, Sharon. She was a dental technician. I was like, why hire someone else and we can have our parents here? Carcasses everywhere sort of thing, but come up here and you're packing uh, bras and, oh. I just love it, eh? The grandparents send maternity wear all over the globe. That's when they're not helping with the grandkids. Now numbering four. All hands on deck. They get competitive. So then I'm like, oh, Tanya, mum said she'd have all four kids on the weekend. And then Tanya's like, well, I'll have all four kids. It was a big move for Adam Southland folks. Spending, what, what am I, 56 now, 53 years in Matera, you know, and lived there all my life, same street. But that street was 1,700 kilometres from the one their grandkids lived on. We used to see my wife's face and he used to be upset and all that, and we thought, nah, what the hell, we only live once. Let's just do it. For the first year, his dad was still reading the Southland Times, and he's like, oh, it's raining in Invercargill today. I'm just blessed with family, and that's what it's all about, eh? You know, you can have all the money in the world, but as long as you're around by family or something, that's, that's, that's why class is richness, is your family. But about those riches? It's all in stock down there. It's like yeah. a pile of bras. <laughs> Three generations of family on a maternity mission. I am living a dream. And, uh, and every day I wake up, you got grandkids around you, and what more can you ask? And we just want to make them proud. Yeah, I'm proud of them. So, so proud of them. <laughs> Very cool. Uh, they sent orders as far away as Puerto Rico, Mexico, Sweden, Russia and South Africa.